Hello everyone. This is a video summary of our paper, Collaborative Metapaths Enhanced Corporate Default Risk Assessment on Heterogeneous Graph. First, let me introduce what is corporate default risk assessment. In our work, our task is to predict whether a small company will fail to repay its loans in the future for small business service in banks. We aim to reduce the difficulty for banks to offer loans for small companies. Thus, it can reduce unfairness for small company applicants. Next, I will introduce our modeling. We adopt graph-based approach and the task is regarded as a node classification problem of graph learning. The key idea is to leverage relations rich in financial activities. Then we summarize our work through these three problems and answer them one by one. The first problem is, how do graphs look like? We adopt heterogeneous graphs for modeling problem. The figure illustrates an example of HD schema. It contains three views. Fund view denotes transaction relations. Industrial view denotes industrial chain relations. And equity view denotes investment relations. The second problem is what hinders HDNs from better results? HDNs have to face two challenges. First, Massive noisy connections hinder HGNs to obtain satisfying results. Second, hierarchical aggregation schemes do not fully exploit multiple semantic connections. In the figure, the data analysis on real financial graphs show that more metapasses between companies and default neighbors lead to higher default risk. It verifies that multiple semantic connections have great impact on the small company defaults. The third problem is how to extract effective risky futures. We propose a novel heterogeneous graph co-attention network, HETCN, for the problem. Our model aims to make use of collaborative metapasses to learn effective risky futures by a well-designed co-attention mechanism. First, the local attention score models the semantic based importance of neighbors by considering holistic metapass context. Second, the global attention score adjusts the importance of neighbors by fusing local attention scores in the different metapasses. Third, we propose a pairwise important learning method which optimizes a margin loss to increase the attention scores of multi metapass neighbors. Okay, that's all. More details can be found in our paper. Thanks to our team and thank you for listening.